It's huge. That's what she said. <laughs> Maybe that's not what she said. Maybe she would rather be dead than say that to you in bed and let it go to both your head. It's your ego that won't let she go. For God's sake, she has a headache and Lord knows this is something she didn't fake because it is so hard. That's what she said. <laughs> Damn son, let her finish her take. She's not done. Maybe that's what she said, but that's not what she meant. Her words often get bent because you're always trying to tell her how she felt. Then she knelt, prayed to God she wouldn't get the belt if she tried to deal back the cards she was dealt. Her unexpressed emotions left welts and your blows felt like bullets that would continue and continue to pelt. I need to get this off my chest. That's what she said. When she went to Hollywood, the land of dodging wood, and people trying to get away with what they could and doing everything that they should not do, ever. Producers trying to hump my leg while I'm acting in a movie. Meanwhile, getting more respect from kids I'm mentoring in juvie. So much tension in my jaw, couldn't release my voice, didn't know I had a choice. Can't you hear my heart? Listening is a lost art. Gloria Steinem saying women realize on Friday they were angry on Monday. Let me tell you that is not a fun day because it is a Sunday of melted emotions that were once ripe with truth and so much sweeter and now they're a dripping hot mess and no longer a delicious treat for her. Realizing now I have been angry since 2002. So many compacted emotions, I don't know what to do. So, I'm trying to put this matter to bed. That's what she said. But it keeps getting back up. What the... So I read it another story, give it another tuck, hoping it will sleep this time if I give it a drink of water and tell it a little rhyme. You pussy, you wussy, you sissy, you diss me. When you throw those words around, I will throw them back at you. Yes, I will throw them like a girl. Cause every time you say them, I'm trying not to hurl in your face. My infinite patience is such a waste. I should just blow. That's what she said. Yo. She's on top. That's what she said. Stop. I need it right now. That's what she said. How? I want to touch it. That's what she said. Fuck it. That's what she said. She wants to be on top of her life. She needs equality for that is right. She wants to touch global freedom and will fight. I have never felt this. Oppressed, repressed, depressed, unexpressed. And yes, I am obsessed because the anger keeps coming and coming it's stunning. That's what she said. Shut up! <laughs> Is this what it feels like to be unleashed? No longer sweeter than a Georgia peach, impeaching my fear with each and every tear. I'm about to woman splain the hell out of something, dear. It was Martin Luther King that said that power without love was reckless and abusive, but that love without power was sentimental and useless. I think I'm feeling the power of love, so I guess I better use it. I'm trying to fit it all in. That's what she said, no. No, that is enough of your stuff. She's angry, she's crying, she is bleeding. Her soul is dying. When do we do something? Now. We can heal it. How? By listening to how we feel. Ow. We have a voice. Bow. We have a choice. Wow. And that is what she actually said.